This video shows you how to make a sewing table or simulate a uh, sewing machine in a floor pit in 60 seconds. This is a, obviously a dining room table. It would be nicer if it didn't have the round edges. Uh, this is a two board table. All I did was open the table, move a board over one notch. Uh, this particular table, the uh, dowel pins, and these are the dowel pins that hold the table together. On one side you have a pin, on the other side you have a hole. And on my table, fortunately, the pins are equally spaced so I could move the uh, board over so I could sit in that space. And the hole's still lined up. If they don't, you can just take a chair, put a couple of boxes under to support the free end so it doesn't get floppy. And here's where I sit. I can sit right in this pit so I'm lined up with a sewing machine. I've got my fabric rolled up. This is Sombrella. And I got it rolled up and I've got it taped so it'll stay the right size to go through the sewing machine. And the, I use the long end of the table for my material, which is accordion folded. On the short end, I just let it fall over the edge because once I get started, gravity is going to help me feed it as it all falls on the floor. Uh, this, is, this seam requires folding over, so I did iron it. I don't recommend ironing it if you're using acrylic which is Sombrella Outdoor or some of these outdoor fabrics because they melt really easy and residential irons are really terrible at temperature. I have a digital thermometer and set on the lowest setting the temperature varied by about 35 or 40 degrees and when you're looking at something that's going to melt when you get around like 200 or so or maybe not quite 200 but they recommend not airing it over 150 degrees. When I have it set for 150 it varies up to maybe 180 but also, you can't tell. I moved the dial just a little tiny bit because it was cool, and it jumped 40 degrees. So, uh, an alternate to trying ironing it with that is to boil a bunch of water in a pretty large uh, flat bottom pot. Uh, water's 212, as you know, but once it's in the pot, it'll cool off pretty quick. You can put a thermometer in there if you have one. You can start ironing when it's maybe 180 or so. Doesn't work terrific because it cools off fast, but. Uh, Better than ruining a hundred bucks or a couple hundred bucks worth of fabric. That's it.